mean, no, I'm certainly, I'm always excited. I'm excited by, I'm excited by interesting languages. I've always been excited by interesting programming language features. Uh, so, you know, I'm excited by Rust. The Rust is very cool. Uh, I'm excited by the challenges of verifying Rust. Uh, I don't know that I, uh, oh, I'm, I'm also excited by other related kind of language design sites. So we have this whole project or a couple of projects with people at Jane Street. Uh, they have this modal uh, extension or modal types extension of OCaml called OxCaml. Oh yeah, um, it just came out. Uh, yes. Uh, so we've been working with them for a while now. We had a paper at Popple this year on on the concurrency, uh, sort of data race freedom uh, part of that. Uh, but we're continuing to work on various things there. I, I think that's a very interesting design point. Uh, it's trying to integrate some ideas from Rust without the full-blown lifetime mechanism, which is technically involved uh, and, uh, and also in a way that's compatible with garbage collection. Uh, so I think that's a very interesting point in the design space and there's a lot of there's a lot of fun stuff to explore there. Uh, so those are, and I also, I'm, I'm also sort of generally, I'm always interested in foundations of separation logic. And I mean, we, we've done a lot of work on improving Iris and making it more flexible over time. And I don't have a, a specific project about that at the moment, but that often, often that comes up as, you know, as you're working on things like my student, Simon, who just graduated, uh, he has, he had a whole, uh, he had, he had, well, he had one project in particular that which was on something called later credits, which came up. Uh, this is a very sort of nerdy, in some sense, it's a very nerdy iris step indexing thing about making it easier to reason about step index models encoded in iris. 